As the country debates the issue that shot into the spotlight by Chief Justice Ibo Archie to decriminalize the possession of small quantities of marijuana, many locals are welcoming the suggestion by the Chief Justice. Channel 5 News today gave the, pub, gave the Tobago public an opportunity to voice their thoughts on the topic. I think that the government getting revenue from rum and the same thing that marijuana does to people, rum does the same thing. So they had to find a way of decriminalizing it, yes. Because alcohol is just as dangerous as the marijuana. I think they should. They should decriminalize small amount of marijuana. I mean, look at how much problems it causes in young people. Imagine Bill Clinton or, Bar or Barack Obama had gotten caught with a joint when they was in college. What would happen to them today? They'd never make it to, to be president. And just think of how many other young lives are cut off, you know, because they get caught with a roach, you know, and they could have gone to be, who knows, scientists, doctors, engineers, prime ministers, presidents, you know. So that is why I think it should be de de uh, decriminalized. Yes, it's a good thing. And from what I see on the, um, with, um, on the TV and so forth, there are medical benefits to marijuana, right, and I honestly believe if they are um, legalizing weed, this other thing they have fight not behind this drug. The price got dropped for one. There wouldn't be any benefit um, in um, pushing weed and so forth. So they should consider it. I mean, you'll have more um, private persons doing a liquor planting, and as such, that will put a dent into the um, marijuana trade. So you'll have less fighting for turf and that because more people who are smoking will plant their own stuff. And so put a big dent in the marijuana trade and so take out a bit of the criminality in it. I went to England two times. And when I was in England, I asked a police officer to, if you could light my, you have a lighter to light my spliff? So I don't, I don't, they, they mustn't have a big amount. If they have a big amount, that means it's a pusher man. But if you have a two joint or a joint in your pocket, I don't, I don't see no, no, nothing with that. It ain't nothing with that. The crisis state of the criminal justice system and the urgent need for remedies to improve the efficiency and the productivity of the system was cited by the Chief Justice as a reason to look at the decriminalization of possession of small amounts of marijuana. Reacting to Mr. Archie's suggestion when contacted, Acting Commissioner of Police Tobago, Mr. Heflin George, refrained from saying whether he was for or against the recommendation. He indicated, however, that it is healthy to have discussions on the issue and changes can only be made when discussions are held across the board as there would be some notable implications.